well done. Well done. Prakash, you can walk with her next. <laughs> so, Thomas, welcome to India and especially Bangalore. Uh, in your previous conversation, you had said that you were lost in India about 16 years ago? Yes, it's, uh, it's been way too long, but it's true that it was 16 years ago I was here, so very excited to be back. Mita, I will take the opportunity to thank, first of all, BJ to, to, to organize this CTL League, and of course with Mita and Inga, the owners of Bangalore Raptors, who have treated us so well, and I'm honored to be part of that team, and I have fantastic teammates, so we're really all excited to be part of this. And what changes do you see in India from then and now? Well, obviously 16 years is a long time. <laughs> Uh, but everything has, you know, gone forward as, uh, as I guess everywhere else, and it's uh, such a rich culture in, in India, which is nice to, to have the chance to to see you again. And uh, with the tennis tradition actually in India, which is very rich as well, it's it's, it's great that they have organized this CTL. I think it's going to all, not only um, help the Indian tennis; I think it's going to be good for tennis in general. And uh, we all players, I know, we're very excited to be to be part of this. So this is exactly what Junior Amrit Raj was saying. He said that you know. Perhaps India will come up with a, uh, you know, a champion really soon. Well, how fast, how, how close do you think we are? Well, I'm really going to share for Ram, that's for sure. I mean, he's, uh, he's a fantastic, uh, fantastic guy and a great player. He's only 20 years old and he's already along the 200 best in the world, which is great. And to wear my shoes like he did today, he's size 48 and I have 44. To be able to walk up back and forth is a great effort. So he's going to be a grand champion for sure. A little bit about your tennis academy that you have. Is that in that's in Sweden? Well, it's uh, not an academy, but it's a little school for very young kids. Um, also coming from Sweden, we also have a very rich uh, tradition in tennis. But uh, unfortunately, we've been um, struggling a little bit lately, and uh, I think it's very important to start early in the sense that you you stimulate a kid to really choose your sport. We have a lot of sports talent in Sweden, but unfortunately, uh, my mind you, we might not choose tennis at the moment and. I do my best to try to get a lot of kids interested in the, in the game. So they don't choose tennis?